Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Badge Plug, and today, if you enjoyed the beginning of this video, make sure to drop a like, and if you're new, hit that subscribe button, and I'm telling you guys, I'm gonna be bringing you more content just like that. But anyway, today, I'm gonna be showing you the best dribble moves in this game for isolating, for whatever you need to do, the best dribble moves in the game. Now, all these clips that I'm showing you in the beginning, what I showed you uh, was a 16 game win streak that me and my boy locked down. Of course, he was on a lockdown defender. Uh, we were playing, we went on a 16 win streak and we hopped off. Now, all these clips right here is from a 28 win streak, okay? So this is not hundreds and hundreds of games. This is literally like 40 games of clips and that's how nasty that this is. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys some highlights of what happened when I was on this 28 win streak. And just look at this, man. Oh my gosh, bro. Listen, you guys understand, bro. If you've been watching my videos, you know that I've been running a play sharp, playmaking first, sharp shooting second archetype with a pure slasher. I've been isolating and I've been winning a lot of my games. Not every single game, you know, obviously every, every one of your favorite YouTubers lose, okay? But, you know, most of the two centers, I'm just saying. But, uh, you know, it's so much harder. I'm making it much harder on myself to ISO with a pure slasher. Because most YouTubers, like G-Man or Stizo, uh, Stizo, I believe he plays with exit route. And I believe he's a defending first, sharp second, or the other way around. Anyway, he's basically a sharpshooter who sits in the corner. All you need is sharpen your name to, uh, to hit shots in the corner. G-Man plays with stretches. And then in this video... I'm playing with a pure stretch and I'm showing you guys what it is like. Now, why I'm saying that is because in like a lot of my recent videos, a lot of them, like for the past month, I think I've been playing with six God and it makes it much harder to isolate when I can't drive in the paint. Like I can rarely, rarely drive in the paint because why would they stay tight on a pure slasher? You know what I'm saying? So this video right here really demonstrates how nasty these are like look at this. Oh my gosh bro this is all throughout the video now first of all i just want to say shout out to this guy for not playing hands up defense at least until he got broke but look at this look at this as soon as i knew he was going to pick up pass it out to the stretch guys if you want me to iso and show you guys clips of me isoing with a pure stretch more often because just look what i'm doing bro when i have an entire court to do whatever i want it's nasty. I mean, it gets really bad, as you've seen in the beginning with all the ankle breakers. Now, shout out to all the people that pull up on me and don't play hands up defense. Look, you guys can add me on Xbox. My gamer tag is Badge Plug YT. All right, Badge Plug YT, as you see on the screen. Okay, I'm, I appear online a lot, almost every time that I'm playing 2K. You know, I'm not afraid of nobody pulling up. Blah blah. blah. I don't really care. Even if I lose, I'm not really that mad. But look at this. RP. RP. But listen, if you pull up on me and you start playing hands up defense when I get takeover because you don't want to get dropped, I'm going to go ahead and warn you that I'm just going to run right by you and shoot the and, and drive in and dunk or pass out to my stretch if your guy picks up. So please don't pull up on me and put your hands up. You're making it you're making the experience of the game a lot less fun. OK, and another thing I want to say is I don't understand how when you're playing hands up defense, it is so rare for you to get broken. Right. So it's basically a defensive mechanic in the game for you to be able to kind of sort of because I can run by you and score easily a mechanic in the game to stop playmaking sharps or stop dribblers. But there's no mechanic in this game if you're under like six, seven to stop a stretch. I can literally jump straight in their face and I can't do anything. But look, shout out to this guy, man. He was a defender and his build and he was not playing hands up defense. So you see what happened to him so but shout out to him for not playing hands up because you know what if he did i would have just ran by, by him and you're gonna say badge bro look look at look what i'm doing to people bro like i'm really out here hurting people's feelings look he's playing hands up so what do i do what do you think i did oh i ran right by him guys stop playing stop pulling up on me and playing hands up defense and yes i'm sick if you hear me sniffling I'm sick. I'm sorry. But I'm still making this video for you guys. 
it this is 40 like 40 games 45 games of clips this took me forever to edit man so if you guys could just drop a like for me that'd be much appreciated but look what i'm doing out here bro it's not fair it's not fair i can do this every single day and i'm gonna keep doing this and showing you guys clips because i know just like from the last video that you guys love these videos right here a lot of youtubers they only show you you know playing one game or two games they play the entire day they play 40 50 games and they'll show you one two games where they play really good but i'm doing this very frequently like this is not something that you know one out of 100 games i'm breaking some guy some guy who's you know his record's one in 100 like i'm really doing this to people look at this like i'm really hurting people out here bro but anyway the most important dribble move why the title has Stizo to do you know why Stizo is in the title is a normal crossover four which you guys have already seen i've already showed at this point normal crossover four your normal crossover changes everything literally everything okay if you don't have a good normal crossover on you're not gonna be a dribble god you're not i'm sorry it is the basis of almost every single combination in the entire game now shout out to this guy too because look you know i was playing i was doing my thing and once i got take over look at this i love that move right there that was nasty that was man r.i.p to him but if you don't have on a good normal crossover bro and i asked these up oh my gosh get up bro get up off the ground but hey shout out to him for not playing hands up defense because it's much easier to stop somebody without playing hands up defense it's just that people are scared to get their ankles broken which i don't bro if i get my ankles broken i get my ankles broken but i'm still trying to win the game even if play sharp has takeover but anyway your normal crossover means everything and this is stizo's normal crossover okay look at this bro oh god this is this is not fair this is really this is all from one win streak as you can see all the people by the court i was appearing online like i said you guys need to add me on xbox my gamer tag is badge plug no spaces just like my youtube name badge plug and then the letter y and the letter t and then you will find me i'm right there you can pull up on me all the time but if don't bro don't pull up on me with two centers don't be that guy don't be that guy you know let, let's let's all be civil here anyway a lot of you know it's funny i read comments when i do these dribble videos sometimes and in every video bro people are like bro you're calling two centers cheese but uh look what you're doing with a play sharp bro i would love to see you do this with a play sharp you know i'm sure there's people that are watching this video that are better dribblers than me i'm sure you guys can do this but it's almost always like dudes that you know they can't do this bro like i'm not just sitting here spamming moves you know this is a lot of practice this is not left riding through a screen like your favorite youtuber who can barely if not even hold a 90 win percentage running two centers like i'm i have a 93 win, per win percentage running isolation okay my last like 700 games i've been isoing and most of it has been with a pure, a pure slasher i have a 93 win percentage okay and you know if i start playing playing with a pure stretch i guarantee you guys i can get my win percentage back up to 95 but look at this this guy thinks oh i'm an elite three play sharp there's no way that badge plug is gonna do this to me right that's what he thinks ladies and gentlemen he he just thinks that you know because he's an elite three nothing can happen to him but boom come on bro pick yourself up green anyway if you guys have made it this far comment down below plug nation join the plug nation if you're new hit that subscribe button it's your boy badge plug you have been plugged in make sure to drop a like on this video man let's go for four thousand likes on this video okay guys if you want more 2k content more dribble moves jump shots vc glitches drop a like on the video okay it's your boy badge plug you have been plugged in make sure to have a good holidays and i'm out peace